are you and Truman up to this weekend? That makes you think I have plans with Truman. Casey, you've gone out with him five weekends in a row. So either he's your new boyfriend or he's replacing me as best friend. <sighs> okay, you're right. I'm being replaced? <sighs> no, Truman is officially my new boyfriend. <sighs> I really like him. He's different than the other guys I've dated. Yeah, I agree. Max and Sam were sweet, nice, and trustworthy. So is Truman. He's just a little unpredictable. Well, I predict he's going to turn out to be an untrustworthy guy who can't commit. Can't commit? He pursued me for months. Let's just drop this, okay? Are we having a fight? <sighs> no, because I know you're just watching out for me, but could you please try and be a little nicer to him? Hey, Casey. Hey. <laughs> Emily. Hi, Truman. It's so nice to see you. What are you crazy kids planning this weekend? Okay, not that nice. <laughs> There's a major bash in Toronto. A bash in Toronto? Why is this the first time hearing of this? How are we going to get there? How am I going to tell my mom? How am I going to find the right outfit? You want to come? You don't want me to come? Do you want to come? Well, if you want me to come, sure. <laughs> trust your best friend obviously and your parents definitely and your siblings usually and certain step siblings virtually never huh emily hey uh yeah casey's not back from whatever extracurricular lameness she's doing oh well mind if i wait yeah suit yourself derek what do you think of truman i don't think of truman Ever. Well, what do you think of Casey dating Truman? Think of that even less. So you think she should stop dating him, too? Who am I to stop Casey from dating some jerk? Her stepbrother? Do you want something to eat? No, thanks. What's the haps, neighbor? Casey and Truman's the haps. Ah, uh, yes. Your new boyfriend. What do you think of him? He's tall. He's got great hair. Aside from the hair, I don't really trust him. Tell you what, why don't I do some digging and see what I can find out? You do that, Edmund? Of course. She's my stepsister. Hmm. I also keep tabs on Keep T. In fact, there's a new candidate for her affections, a certain Marvin. I've already opened a file on him. Impressive. Not every brother looks out for his sisters like you do. Oh, don't waste your time with him. I'm the sensitive brother. Nothing to brag about, Ed. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. With George Way, I'm a little bit scrambled, so I thought I'd make... Scrambled eggs? With toast. Ah, huh. so, Casey, uh, care to shed some light on this dark and mysterious bad boy you're dating? No, thank you. Mmm. Mom, these scrambled eggs are great. Nice and runny. Derek, what do you think about Truman? Oh, I like him. Just as much as I like Casey. So why don't you like him, Derek? Mom, who cares if Derek doesn't like him? I like him. And the fact that Derek doesn't like him should be the parental seal of approval. If he's so likable, then how come he got kicked out of his old school? He got kicked out of his old school? Uh, Casey, do you really think that he's the kind of guy you should be dating? Mm. There is such a double standard in this house. Derek and Edwin get to date whoever they want, but Lizzie and I get the third degree. Uh, Edwin doesn't date who he wants. He asked out Cheryl, Andrea, and Debbie, and they all turned him down. Very funny, Liz. You know, maybe that's why Marvin agreed to go out with you. Who's Marvin? Edwin, you're such a... Caring guy. Thank you for noticing. Oh. Hey, Lizzie, what's up? How's the homework going? Mom, if you want to ask about Marvin, just ask. Okay, who's Marvin? I'd rather not answer that. I'd rather you did. <sighs> Fine. I asked Marvin out for ice cream this Saturday, okay? Well, of course it's okay. Especially since I'll be joining you. <laughs> Good one. You almost had me going there, Mom. <laughs> I'm serious. A mother has to keep an eye on her daughters, Lizzie. I don't even know this mystery, Marvin. Oh, brother. That's not a bad idea. Truman, did you 
you care for some tea while we're waiting for Casey to come down? Uh, okay. My husband George is away on business, which is too bad because I know that he would have loved to have gotten to know you better, too. That is too bad. Edwin Venturi, Casey's caring stepbrother. Truman French, Casey's caring boyfriend. I'll be the judge of that. Edwin, is 